Hey Collective, what's up? It's your girl Infamous Empress Rose coming to you guys with a message. Please like, subscribe, share my channel, take what resonates, leave the rest. Also flip the rose as need be. Please flip the rose as need be. This is not your message. Please do not try to make it fit. And this is a timeless message. We're going to go ahead and clear out the energy. Most high spirit guys, ancestors, I ask that you consecrate this deck for guidance and wisdom for the collective. I ask that you consecrate this deck to bring light where there is darkness for the collective spirit. Spirit, what do you want the collective to know? Okay, so we have the waiting game here. The waiting game. So it's something that you you want, okay? I'm picking up like it's stability. You're wanting to rest. You're wanting to be able to rest and rejuvenate, okay? Like a lot could be going on where you're not able to rest the way that you want to, okay? Spirit is saying that you may have to make some sacrifices, okay? Something is being delayed. Something is being delayed, yeah, I'm picking up like you feel like you are moving around too much. You got a lot going on, a lot of responsibilities. Someone is wanting success. Victory. Spirit is saying it's a waiting process. You got to be patient. It's a waiting process. You have to be patient. Things will balance out. Okay? Things will balance out. I'm hearing something coming full circle. You just have to be patient. Someone could be working two jobs, two and three jobs to make ends meet. Like someone is exhausted. They're tired. They're burnt out. They are burnt out. The number two, the number 12 is significant to this message. Yeah, someone feel like something is being restricted. Let's get some clarity. Yeah, I'm hearing like someone feel like they're stuck in like quicksand, like they can't get themselves out of this quicksand. Four four is significant here. Yeah, this is definitely surrounding like stability, money. Someone is wanting to rest. They're not able to rest. A workaholic. Work, 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 work. Someone is working like crazy. Yeah, I'm hearing like you just want one job. Making enough money where you can just work one job. What else we got? Yeah, I'm hearing like you don't even have time for yourself. You don't even have time for yourself. You have the justice the justice card here, yeah. Libra is very significant here. 411 is significant here. The number 11, the number 4 is significant. Spirit is saying things are going to balance out. Yeah, you're trying to figure out why things are taking so long. Yeah, what you're not doing right. You're trying to figure out, like, what it is that you're not doing right. Why is something taking so long? Why is this money taking so long? Why is this success, this success taking so long? This victory is taking so long. Queen of Cups. Somebody could be a Gemini, a Cancer. Yeah, someone is wanting stability, emotional stability. Yeah, wanting the nine of cups. Someone want to be satisfied, happy with life, at peace. Someone is not at peace because they have so much going on. Somebody could be a single mom, taking on a lot, okay? Got to take care of the bills, the kids. The home.
The number nine is significant here. What else we had? Yeah. So one main priority right now is stability, being stable, making enough money where they don't have to work multiple jobs. Whatever it is that you've been manifesting, it's coming in, okay? It's coming in slow, but it's going to come in. Things are going to take a turn, okay? You just got to be patient. The number eight is significant here. Somebody could be a Sagittarius. The temperance, yeah, balance. A renewal, a rebirth. The number 14 and number 5 is significant to this message. Yeah, you could be feeling bitter, okay? Comparing yourself to others, your life to other, others. Spirit is saying to stop doing that. To stop doing that. Your time is coming. There's no need for you to compare yourself to anybody, to anybody, your life to anybody. Your time is coming. You have to be patient. What else we are? Somebody could be coming to your aid. Somebody could be coming to your aid, helping you out. This could be a soulmate. This could be a lover. Somebody coming in. Eternal love here, soulmate. Somebody could be coming to your rescue, your aid, to help you. So you could be dealing with, like, hardship. A lot. You could be dealing with a lot right now. Yeah, we have commitment here. This is a new a new contract in love. Somebody is coming to your assistant, your aid. You could be 34 years old, 50 years old. 49, 48, 45. What else, spirit? Someone is backed up on bills. This person is coming to your aid. Hmm. Whoever this person is, they could be very religious. With the libation card here. Or this could be like a church, a, a charity, an organization that's helping you. Yeah, we have good news here. Good news. So you could apply for like assistance, energy assistance. And you're getting help. Okay, you're getting help with bills. Maybe clothes for your kids, clothes for you. Somebody could be 42 years old. Or this person, they could be putting you or directing you, giving you like resources. Places that can help you, that can assist you. Yeah. What else, Spirit? You could be 26 years old. You could be someone that's very stubborn, that don't like to ask for help. I'm 
I'm picking up the same energy um, that came out for the new moon message. What else we have? Yeah, balance. Your balance will be restored. Balance will be restored. What else, Spirit? Give us some more clarity. You're going to boss up. You're going to boss up. You want to be successful. You want to be victorious. Spirit is saying you are going to boss up. You have to remain confident. Confidence is key. Confidence is key when it comes to your situation. What else do you have? Whoever this person is, this man, I'm picking up this is a man because we have homeboy here. Okay? You two can start off as friends. You two can start off as friends. This person could be a Taurus. And then you will end up falling in love. Catching feelings. Because we have intense emotions, passion here. Catching feelings for this person. And I'm picking up, you two are going to spend a lot of time together. You and this person. It's like they're going to grow on you. Because I don't even think you are even focused on a relationship. You're trying to get your shit together. Yeah, you're trying to get ahead of the game. That's not even where your focus is. What else, Spirit? But this person is, is going to be your soulmate. This is a new contract in love. Something that's going to happen unexpectedly. What else we have? Yeah, this is going to be something that happened out the blue. <laughs> like, it's going to be surprising to you. Yeah, someone is a hopeless romantic. Matters of the heart here. Moving forward. Yeah, you and this person getting together. Becoming one. Being in a committed relationship. This could be, you, you could go to church as well. You could be someone that's religious, okay? This could be somebody at your church. What else, Spirit? But they're coming to your aid, your assistant. Pisces. They could be a Pisces or you could be a Pisces. And they are such a generous person. They are such a kind-hearted person, whoever this is. Spirit is saying congratulations. They're going to be very supportive, whoever this person is. They could, like, come out their pocket to help you. And they are very humble. This person is very humble. Humble. Spirit said you are needing to release self-limited beliefs. Believe in yourself. Stop doubting yourself. Believe. Have faith that you will be successful. Everything is happening in divine timing. Not when you want it to happen, but in divine timing. In divine timing. Because I'm picking up that you are doing the work, okay? You're taking care of your responsibilities. You're taking care of your kids, okay? Trying to maintain. But it's the way you're thinking. It's, it's your thoughts. Your thought pattern is the way you're thinking. You're not thinking like a boss. Spirit is saying you need to think like a boss. Speak it into existence. 
speak that shit into existence. Don't doubt yourself. Let's get some charms. And I'm gonna go ahead and end this message. The sun, you want the sun. This is what you want. You wanna be in the sun. You wanna be able to live life without worrying about money and bills. You want the sun. But again, it's your thoughts. You have to think positive. Think like a boss. Yeah, you want the, the pleasures of life. You want to be happy. But you are doubting yourself. You are doubting yourself. And whatever this is that you have manifested, Spirit is saying it's protected. You just got to change up certain things. Okay? You got to change up certain things so that it come to you. Because the universe hear you. But do you really have faith? Do you really believe? Do you really trust the universe? Do you? The universe is saying, spirit is saying, remain steadfast. Ground yourself. Ground yourself. Stop doubting yourself. And I'm going to go ahead and end this message. Thank you.